Yeah, man. Join me for free. Got a medium sized pot, which we're going to be using. All right. Um, similar recipe, which I've been using over the last um, few days. It's not changing on this recipe yet. I need to change the recipe, but I won't be changing the recipe yet. Because this recipe is a very good recipe for the winter season and to help to clean out the gut and that's what we are about right, so here it is i'm going to get Yeah, I did have a video earlier, but I said to myself, I just want to, you know, I mean, keep you guys uh, update with them recipe because this recipe is a different kind of recipe from the one that which I did before. But um, I just want to share this one this evening with you. So you guys have an option of things that you can do at home. So we're going to put a few cloves in the water. All right. A few cloves. Scrape the skin, and you don't have to remove the skin to be honest. But yeah, you can leave the skin on it. So, the reason why I'm trying to push um, these recipe right now because the way that change number one. That's why I'm trying to give you guys all of these recipe because weather changing at the moment. I don't know if you guys notice that the weather is change weather. But I grate the ginger. Yeah, the weather is change. SJ, thank you so much. And Thank you so much. Good evening. Thank you so much. Blessing. Thank you so much. Good evening, Chef Ricardo. Looking good. Enjoying that beetroot juice and raspberry, blueberry. Okay. Nice one. Change enough weather, guys. And you'll have to boot up the immune system with ginger. Lots of ginger. And natural ingredients like these. Wet. It's 
doesn't nice this time of the year, but we have to just give thanks. Yeah. So you need certain kind of recipe to boot up your immune system. Alright, type out these. You see this? Very good. The garlic. These things fight against coal and flu. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you something, one of you guys. One might not understand. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you something. All right. You know, cause the other day. gonna turn off the cooker we don't want it to boil I think this four cloves of garlic is pretty good all right let's turn off the cooker see turn it off just like that I'm gonna say something to you who are watching I'm gonna tell you this and I saw I know that something is working very good because I've been around lot of people who have cold, flu, coughing, sneezing. Craig, big up yourself. Thank you so much for seeing it on the show. And sniffing, all sort of stuff. Yes, the other day, I went up in the rain. And when I went up in the rain, I um, start to, um, what do you call this one now? Um, like, <clears throat> like, well, it wasn't a sore throat or anything. You know what I mean? It's just my... Okay. We don't even want it to boil. It's not to boil. Okay? We need to take this off the cooker. We don't want it to boil. I'm going to turn off this. Yeah. I don't want it to boil. That's a red flag. Yeah. All right. So, I'm going to say something. And I saw I know that something good is working. So roughly about, um, let me see, how long now? Roughly about, it's about 10 years ago. 10 years ago, guys. I'm going to tell you this. 10 years ago, or say, 8 years ago. All right. I used to really sicky, have sore throat, have cold, have runny nose, have sniffy nose. Now, I'm going to tell you this. Over the last few years, since I'm drinking these kind of teas recipe, I do not have none of those kind of symptoms. And trust me, I'm telling you the honest truth. No symptom like that. All right. I remember back in the days, <laughs> I would be, anytime you start to touch um, November, I think the weather is not like, 20 years ago or 15 years ago 15 years ago in England was very cold very very cold lots of snow um, really bad till you came and go to work I don't think it's like that I think the weather is changed a lot but it's still a little bit cold okay so I know since I start to drink these natural teas I do not see that happen to me anymore like what used to happen to me back in the days all right um i don't have cold or flu like that anymore if i get a little bit of <clears throat> or a little bit of unless um i might drink something and you know what i mean back of my throat but it's a very long time i don't have sore throat um cold or flu and all of those things is a very long time i don't have it um no pharmacy or sickness or anything and i know back in the days 10 years ago or say eight years ago i'm going to tell you i used to be like as it touch november december january february march april my head would be going off because the time is cold and you know what i mean you have to be having on gloves and lots of people who live like Canada and certain places are very cold will understand. But if you're not living in a cold country, you won't understand. Because 
I think the weather in England has changed because I remember 50, 20 years ago, the weather wasn't like this. No. All right. Damn time. Uh, <laughs> from September, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, April, May, June, will then the seed start. So I'm going to tell you this. Rick Nerick, thank you so much. The weather is a little bit different now. So, um, yeah, the weather, the weather is changed a lot. And, yeah, I can't believe, man. It's amazing to know that all the weather has changed. And, you know what I mean? But if you find yourself... Um, catching a lot of cold or flu or you've been very sicky sicky or you um, um like coughing and sneezing and all of those things is the immune system is down all right the immune system is down the immune system need boots set up and that's why i've been doing this kind of tease over the last couple of days drinking up a lot of these kind of teas because these tea help to boost up your immune system and fight against bacteria in your throat in your gut because i'm gonna say something guys in your stomach it is that's where everything has started from in your gut your gut yeah right it's a place where you have to take care of it in every ways as you can to make sure I tell you take care of your gut all right but I'm gonna tell you this guys I'm really happy that you know I mean over the last few years and not like before everything has changed but back in the days I'm gonna tell you I know I used to be sicky sicky um, taking a lot of medication like paracetam nerofen I remember those days and and I talk about it many times. So I'm sharing that with you guys. That to tell you, if you find yourself taking all of these pills on a regular basic, that means something is definitely wrong. Okay? Those things mash up your kidney and your liver. All right? Yeah, man. So just be careful of them. Don't take them too much. Unless if you, you know, on a choice and it is an emergency and it is worse, then you can take it. But otherwise, just don't take them just because you have a little headache or you have a little bit of cold or a flu. No, don't do that. That does mash up your kidney and your liver. Yeah, big up yourself. Thank you so much, guys. All right. But I'm going to tell you this. To be honest with you, I'm so glad and I'm giving thanks that, yeah, I change up my eating habit and my diet and start to drink up a lot of natural teas and natural juice and uh, it makes me feel totally different today. Some people might have wondered, sometimes I don't explain all the things I'm really good because I'm not a doctor, okay? I never work into a pharmacy. I only do my own little research and I share my ideas and tips with you, which is very good and which is can help you at home. All right, yes, just remember, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a nurse, I never work into a pharmacy, I never go and do any study or research, like to be a doctor or nurse. I only do my research, what is good for the human body and what is good for your health, to keep you healthy and to keep you fit at home. And, um, and I recognize natural stuff is really good because it keep you healthy joseph thank you so much all right people that's the good news this evening all right so you might see i repeat myself over this tea is a reason remember to get yourself a copy of my book from poverty to purpose chef ricardo secret recipes to success it's available on amazon go over to amazon and grab yourself one okay yeah man Grab yourself one of this book that it is something totally good for you. Now, as I said before, if you know you're a person who are doing a lot of drinking and smoking and all of those things, my advice, cut down on it. 
okay yeah man cut down on it and look after your health because all of those things um doesn't good for your immune system just gonna mess you up in the long run don't think about now think about 30 years down the line all right yeah so but that's the message guys we only can share ideas with you okay seems like i hit this beautiful one look at that Tell you something. I drink one cup of this tea earlier, you know, but it was with, with white onion. It was amazing, man. I wasn't even gonna do this video tonight, and I say, you know what? Why not share it with my audience? You know, you're not gonna. It's not that. It's not the end of the world if I share something again with my audience. I said, this is what you guys can drink. So this one, this is ginger, garlic. And cloves mixed together. All right, these are some powerful winter drink. Now we're gonna get some honey. I think my honey is gonna finish. I need to get some. This honey is the best. As you guys can see, there's no sugar in it. It's clear honey. I brought this in the health shop, so I need to get another one. It's the best. Uh, if you're going to the supermarket and you're going to this big brand supermarket and buying honey, you're not getting good honey. You're getting rubbish. You have to go to the health shop or you go to a proper place and get good honey like this. All right. Pure organic raw honey. Active raw honey, this guy is amazing. Very good. Just imagine you have a cold or a flu, a runny nose, sniffy nose. These are stuff you need to have in your house. Never run out of these at home. Honey and all of these things. It's amazing, guys. Okay? Raw active honey. So, just want to give you guys a little bit of tips and ideas of what you guys, you know what I mean, can do at home. You don't need to put in a lemon or in a lime in this. You can just drink it naturally. As it is garlic ginger and some cloves tea that's it for tonight okay many people are gonna say what's the benefit for that there's a lot of benefit right here sir because when you go to the supermarket and you buy a bottle of fizzy juice you know exactly what's gonna do to your body so you know exactly what it's gonna do something good to your health okay it's gonna help you with reduce your inflammation in your system and number one, garlic is very good for your cholesterol. It's gonna help you with your cold and your flu. Grace, big up yourself. So there's a lot of things that's going on right here. Beautiful cup of tea. And I would encourage you to enjoy this tea.